What's up guys and welcome back to the Outer Worlds. I am your host Captain Jeff Goat alongside my two hench peoples and we are back to the mission at hand repair the radiators. Now before we get started if I could please get you guys to like comment subscribe turn on notifications and spread the word to show your support for the series and the channel. It'd be greatly appreciated. But guys let's cool down this big ass ship. All right. Logs. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Psycho. Ta-da! The temperatures are dropping. Good. Stop by once you found your way out of there. Alright, yep, yeah, we'll we'll do. Oh my goodness, guys, that was Ow my ankle! That was intense. But we did it! Success! Woo! How do you guys feel? I feel amazing. Absolutely amazing. All right, now, where did we go? Oh, this way. Yep, there she is. This is Halcyon B. We interrupt your rest. My boards are returning to green. Good. What a weight that is off my shoulders. You're welcome. I don't normally tolerate outsiders mucking about in my station's guts, but you're all right. Yeah, I know. The temperature should be dropping as we speak. I'll see to it the crew knows who kept us all from boiling alive. Yeah, you best. If you've got time, I believe Edna has a comms issue that could use your attention. I've also authorized Doc and Furu to sell you our premium meds. Ooh. Thank you. Um. What's it like being command here? I don't have faith in board. Whoa, we'll be on our way. Woo, leveled up, baby. Yeah. All right. Now let's see here. We have enough bits, guys. We got enough bits. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm so happy. I am so happy right now. You don't even know. Grandma! Grandma, I got the bits! Gracious. I was just sitting down for tea. Well, I got the bits, Grandma. Fantastic. Do be careful with it, dear. I will. Because these keys tend to be a tad hard to acquire. I know this. You should have a chat with Lilia Hagen in the sublight offices. She's a dear. You'll love her. Now, Will I now? Was there anything else? Um, yeah, I wanted to trade a little bit. Won a charming copper kettle off that girl who runs the pub. She's a fierce arm wrestler. But she's no match for your pal Gladys. You said it, Grandma. All right. Sell. Um. Let's see. What do I want to sell? Arian's flintlock? Ooh, that's kind of cool. Um. Let's sell. Um, hmm. Tactical shotgun. I want to keep that. Welder's goggles. You can have that. Uh, I want to keep my health stuff. How many junks? Oh, yeah. Here you go. Takes all my junks. Okay, Grandma. See ya. That'll be all. Hey, boss. You need a tour guide? I've seen all 12 episodes of Terror on Monarch. Oh. Kind of an expert. Who? I'm going to be able to set foot on the whole other planet. Yeah. I know Monarch's a moon. I think it counts anyhow. It does. Definitely does. Always counts. Now let's see really quick. Um, let's upgrade myself. Um, hmm. Movement. Um... Hmm. Movement, movement, um, extra on headshots. Vendor buying, dialogue skills. Um, let's see. Why can't I do the one vending machine thing? Surely, uh... Increase my walk speed. Hmm. Is this it? No. You know, I want to unlock the ability to fast travel when I'm, I'm injured or you know full. 
So let's see. Um, do stealth a bit. And more on tech. And then there we go. Good. Excellent. Oh, wait. Nope. So this is the main quest. Go to Monarch. Um, then I got to do that thing for her on Monarch. Um, speak to Lisa. Let's do that. Where's Lisa? Is she here? Oh, she is. Wonderful. Speak to Lisa's and then hopefully that will you know, being close to the side quests. You guys look great. I just want to say, I'm so proud of you. Hello. What the? Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. I. Welcome to Sublight Salvage and Shipping, a legitimate business for legitimate consumers. You're screwed up, dude. You, you got lost scars. The unreliable. Yes, yes, I am. The name's Captain Jeff Goat. See, it's right there. Miss Lily has been expecting you. I'll unlock the door. Thank you. Thank you, Tobias. Um, okay, thank you. Hello. Ooh, Lilia. Hi, Hoochie. So you're the new captain in town. Yeah. I was hoping you'd make your way to my office. Uh -huh. Saves me the work of hunting you down. Ooh, you can hunt me down Lilia anytime, Hayden, Mama. CEO and executive director of Aggressive Operations. Ow. I'm guessing you already know about Sublight. Otherwise, you wouldn't have come. Oh, I would have came, yeah. Name's Jeff Goat, Captain of the Unreliable. Charmed. It's nice to see the Unreliable again. Useful it's actually ship. called the Goat. Hawthorne was my contractor. I'd recognize that leaky boat of his anywhere. Well, I'm fixing it up. Um, I didn't kill him. Um, don't let Ada hear you calling her ship names. Um, get to the point. Again. I have a salvage job for someone light on corporate ties with a reliable set of wings. Mm. But there's a catch. There's always a catch. Just like in the serials. If you have a nav key to Stellar Bay, the job's yours. Interested? Uh, I can get into Stellar Bay? Yeah. One of my guys in Stellar Bay has a lead on some high-grade salvage. But he went dark before he could spill the goods. Okay. We arranged a drop at the Saltuna Warehouse's loading dock. Mm -hmm. Find whatever he left there and take it to Fallbrook. My gal Catherine will be expecting you. All right. I'll take it. Now get going. Catherine will brief you on the details when you check in with her at Fallbrook. Okay. One last thing. What? When you're on the job, keep a pair of eyes in the back of your head. Understood? Oh, that's what I have these two for. Understood. You'll do fine. Probably nothing to worry about. Probably. Better not be. Yeah, see? We'll be fine. Well, if not, you're gonna pay for it, Alex. Alright. Very nice. Okay. Let's go, guys. Yeah, it's pretty nice. What do you think, Pavardi? It's pretty cool. All right, so let's see our missions now. Um, God, we, we're doing good now. So we got to go... Faction quest, space-time continuum. Let's do that one. Why not? Either way, we got to go to our chip. So let's go, guys. Whew! I feel amazing. I want to check out my... I don't got anything there. Um, why can't I... Oh, never mind. Yeah. Let's put the pistol here. Let's see if I can tinker with it a bit. Excuse me. Okay, where is... um? Let's repair everything just so that way it's 
Ta-da! Um, tinker. There we go. Let's tinker. Um, tinker? No. Install mod. Anything I can install? No. I guess not. Okay. Ooh, some nice pistols. All right, guys, we are on our way. Excellent. Oh, I'm so excited. More missions, more space adventures. Whee! It's gonna be glorious. <clears throat> Absolutely glorious. By the way, guys, once again, happy Halloween. I hope you guys have all had a awesome Halloween, taking your kids trick-or-treating. Trick-or-treating if you use the kids. And um, regardless, for everyone eating lots of candy and looking cool while doing it. But not too much, because, you know, don't want to have to use the diet uh, toothpaste. <laughs> what? Huh? Oh, oh it's just I right. am alert and awake. Not to worry. I take our ship security highly seriously. Yeah, I'm sure you do. <clears throat> um, transfer. Let's see. Um, hmm. Store, yeah. <coughs> All right, that's good. <coughs> oh, we got to go to Monarch. Oh, no, not this place again. All right, let's go. Warning, dangerous. Let's go to, to the landing pad. Whee! We're now in orbit of a stellar bay, Captain. All right. Um, hmm. I seriously think we should take Sam. Felix, I'm sorry, but Sam's coming with us. <coughs> Just because, again, Sam is a robot. And Sam needs to level up. Felix does too, but you know, he'll have his chances. I don't want to help the chairman and minister clerk. They seem like douches. Look at them. Making Abraham Lincoln work. I swear he looks like Abraham Lincoln, the blue dude. Something's fishy achievement earned. Wonderful. All right. We made it, guys. We're on the good part. Woo. Oh, God. What the hell was that? Oh, uh, that sucked. Um. What? What happened? I just, whoop, fell off. Oh, my goodness. Clip that chat because that was hilarious just we made it <laughs> oh my goodness sometimes guys i can be i can be the banana boob total potato move right there but you know i'm i just woke up like a week ago okay you know i just woke up um you know what Sam, you're gonna stay here. Alright, I'm just gonna take I am gonna take Felix. Cause Felix probably would have told me, Hey boss, look out for that freaking ledge right there that he falls into. And that is so gross. Lady, you are eating borstwurst. 
That looks nasty. Just pulling it off of him. Ugh. It's like a screwed up pig. Ugh. Nasty. But that worst does look good. Mm. Probably just me. I'm hungry. I need to eat something. All right. Okay. How do I go down? Hello? Oh, there we go. Ow. Hello. Hey, hold on there. I gotta sign you in. Okay. Don't think I've seen you around. No. That means you must be new to Stellar Bay. You are new here, right? Possibly. Grim. Um. Well, that is my ship. Yeah. I knew it. See, I made what you call a logical deduction. Did you now? You must have seen those UDL gunships on your way in. There's only three of them these days. Still, they tend to scare folk off. Yeah. Um, what are they doing there? You may not have heard, you being new, but Stellar Bay hardly ever gets off-world traffic. Us being cut off by the board and all. Oh. Which means I never get to do this part, but I've been practicing. So, here goes. All right. On behalf of Monarch Stellar Industries, welcome to Stellar Bay. Home of the freshest sal tuna in Halcyon. Please state your name for the records. Um, Captain Jeffco. Swell. There's one for the logs. I'm even going to give you your own entry code. Thank you. I'm not supposed to do that. It's against procedure, but Mr. Sanjar isn't so strict about the rules here. Besides, I got a lot of empty entries to fill. Well, right on, buddy. Um, I'm going to go have a look around. Mr. Sanjar will be mighty pleased to meet you. If you see him over at headquarters, maybe you could tell him I did a bang-up job of welcoming you? Sure thing. Oh, and if you're headed that way, maybe you could do me a favor? Ugh, <sighs> fine. What is I it? I got this Rizzo's Rangers Tossball poster coming in on the next sublight shipment. Signed by the Black Hole himself. Wow. Only I haven't Don't heard care. anything in a while. You think you could check with Celia to see if it's come in? Yeah, I guess. Thanks a bunch. Celia works for Mr. Sanjar in the MSI building next to the bar. Uh, always there, so you can't blah, 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 blah. Ah, you talk too much, kid. God dang, guys. You're not always doing stuff for people. Can't handle it. Ah! Another yacht club. Very nice, very nice. Monarch, okay. Now where do I go? Obviously go this way. Nope, obviously not. Stellar Bay. She's always cranky. Oh, it's like I go in here. More than usual. Shut up! Don't care. Are you person to talk to? Catherine, the new shipment will be ready when it's ready. All right. Dang girl. To come up here What's wrong with your hair? Herself if she's in such a hurry. It's like worms. Take it easy, I'm just looking around. Catherine said she'd shove you in a box you kept running your mouth like that? Yeah. Did she now? Well, I can see I was mistaken. Because if Catherine really had sent you, there'd be a lot more expletives in your message. I hope you can forgive my temper. This job has been running me ragged lately. That's all right. First, my autoloader foreman stages a walkout, and now my chief pescatological health manager is missing. Sounds like bad stuff. Your chief what? Braxton. He's in charge of getting the fish fat, but also making sure they don't get too many tumors. Okay. He's a real wizard with pharmaceuticals, but he has creative notions of working hours. Comes with living in a free colony, I guess. Yeah, I guess. Um, uh, so find him and drag him out by his ears, yeah. I would if I weren't busy here picking up his slack. Oh. Since you don't seem to be constrained yourself, Maybe you could check up on him. He lives in the apartments. Sure, why not? Tell I'm him doing crap Velma for everyone said else. to get his lazy ass down here, or she might start noticing those extra drugs he's been taking from supply. Ooh. Something else on your mind? Um. Uh, Subraction of stealing drugs. Yeah. Sublight boss out of Fallbrook. Handles most goods that come in or out of Stellar Bay. Has a mouth like a ground six spacer. Okay. Um, your Gail foreman. Herrick, runs the autoloader operators. 
He thinks I don't pay them enough for flipping switches and turning dials. No one gets paid enough. So the job's easy, but you're not doing it? Something smells here. I mean, everything smells in here, but something's fishy. Uh, wait. Yeah. He and his whole crew walked out. Say they won't come back unless I pay them more. Ah. Uh, I can talk to him. You mind slapping him around a little while you're at it? Sure. I'm joking. Mostly. Unless you can do it without hurting his job performance. If you can find a way to get him back to work, I'll make it worth your while. Okay. Check the Yacht Club. He's usually there. All right. Um. See you later. God dang. All this stuff's to do. All this stuff's. Move. Thought it was a place to go to. Apparently it's not. What's in here? Hello? Hello? No? Eh. Climb, climb. Alright. Now where the hell am I going? Ah! Ow, my ankle! Ooh. Oh. Space choice found a flaw in you. What? During your adventure, you may... Things may happen to your character that can trigger a flaw offer. Taking the flaw is optional, but doing so provides you with a perk. Choice is yours. Okay. So, found a flaw in your acrophobia. After repeatedly falling from great heights, you no longer function well when the ground is far beneath you. Effects. Blah, 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 blah. Perk point. Um, sure, why not? Um, hmm. I don't know. There. Whatever. I don't even cares anymore. So is this stealing? Really? No, I don't want to steal it. It's not worth it. Eh, eh, eh. Come on, let me. Please let me up. Really? You guys suck. Alright, where do I go? I got so many missions now. Um. I don't even know. I don't even know. Ah! Hey, wait, I need to talk to you. And the little bastard's slippery, right? On account of its blood, so it's it's sliding all over the place, trying to crawl away. Okay. Getting so I can't tell the tell the blood from the mud. Gross. Excuse me. Don't interrupt, it's rude. But I gotta get in wow. there, get right in that baby rap stomach and dig it out. If so much as a drop of stomach acid got on that medallion, I'd... Shit, I don't know what I'd do. Might be I'd hunt every damn wrapped out there. I'm sure you would. Right. What are you staring? Wait. Uh, from around here. Who are you? Jeebus. I'm Jeff Goat. Captain Jeff Goat. Ooh, charmer. Don't get a lot of that around here. Folks mostly grump at me about how I should join the MSI payroll. Mm-hmm. Nice change of pace. Buy me a drink, will you? Sure, why not? Outstand! What are you doing in Stellar Bay, stranger? Hoping to uh, get you to do stuff for me. Well, 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 well. Let's get down to Brass Nuts then, shall we? Mm -hmm. Brass... Wait, that ain't it. Brass Rats? Let's... Let's talk business. Yeah. I'm headed back out there after I sober up. Okay. If you want a guide sooner than that? 
You have to get me something to clear my head. Um, sure. What do you need? Outstanding. Our dispensary here maintains a stock of, uh, well, I don't rightly know what they are. Steroid or caffeine somethings? Uh-huh. Pill. They're very good. All right. I'm cut off for the month on account of needing one just about every damn day. But I'm sure you've got your wily ways. Fetch me one and we'll be all set. Sure. All right. Uh, medical, yeah. Well, they work. We got a deal or what? All right, I'll be back. Later. But get out of my way, chair. I got other stuffs to do. Now, who's the one person I'm supposed to talk to? I don't want to steal it. New face, huh? You from off world? Maybe. Captain Jeff. Jeff Goat of the Goat. A ship captain? Well, I'll be. Here, let me buy you a drink. Thank Consider you. Consider an MSI welcome. Why don't you grab a chair? Sit a spell and revel with us. A little bit? Oh. By the smell, he's been reveling enough for you both already. Oh, uh, shut up, Pravardi. Um, we need to talk about Velma. Sure thing. What did you want to discuss? Um. Uh, yeah. Nope. I'm calling her bluff. If she wants to threaten us, we'll see how she likes it when Sanjar finds out she gave Sublight even more dominion in Stellar Bay. Ooh. How long did you miss work? Forever, but we've each saved up our bits, and I stashed them safe in my home by the diner. I reckon we could last a week or two at least. Oh, wow. Good for you. Uh, any suggestions? If I that, I'd have tried it. Talking reasonably got me nowhere. Maybe you'll fare better. The others wanted to blackmail her, but we're above that. Besides, them are just rumors. We got no proof they're true. Mm hmm. Um. I would never blackmail? endorse such an untoward tactic, you know, but, well, there's rumors that Velma's taking a cut off the profits. So far, it's just gossip, you know, but if there was any proof to be had, it'd be in the Saltuna warehouse, I reckon. Mm. Why are you celebrating? Me my friends have taken our destiny into our own hands. We're untethered, free of responsibility and worldly cares. Good for you. Well, as long as we don't run out of bits. But until the windfall's gone, we're riding high. See, we just walked out on our work. Had enough, we did. So now we're striking. Good for you. Um, well, good luck with that. Why, thank you. Our supervisor, Velma, goes on and on about quarterly profits and meeting quotas. But that ain't what Sanjar promised us. Velma refuses to negotiate, so we're refusing to work. I hear you. We won't go back until she agrees to pay us fair and proper. Us on Monarch, we're free from the board, you know? Yeah. We have the right to lobby for better hours and pay. True that. We need to talk about Velma. I will talk to you later. Caleb's doing the talking. Oh, okay. Well, fine. Let's see. Um... Oh yeah, let's do the grim thing. We can do that real quick. Excuse me, citizens. Could I get another greeting? And welcome Ooh. to Monarch Stellar Industries. I producers and purveyors of the finest Saltuna and Halcyon. I like your hair. What can I do for you today? Be my hoochie. Um Grim asked you me to check on you. Sending you is the first bright idea I've seen from that man, because I told him to stop bothering me about it a week ago. I still don't know anything about it, but if you want to help him, Velma's the one to ask. Okay. She's in the warehouse. But I'll warn you, Grim wore her patience thin a long time ago. Okay. Um, so they have money troubles? Or is he not paying you on account of how he tried to fix a thing his own self and busted it even worse? And then said you wasn't fixing it fast enough, so he's docking your wages again? Not that I got any prior experience with such. Not at all. Mr. Nandi treats us all right and pays us well. I just spent most of my paycheck on Raptid on acid. Oh. Do you normally blow your money on Raptid on parts? Laws, no. 
Sometimes it's canid teeth or mantis horn wings. Whatever Sebastian has in stock, really. Hey, eh? Why are you buying it from Sebastian? So I can talk to him, of course. Oh. He doesn't get going about much else. I reckon she's got a little bit of a squish on this villa. I, I get that. He's sort of the strong, silent type. Ooh. Unfortunately, my apartment's kind of filling up with his stuff. And some of the neighbors are complaining about the smell. Uh, maybe I can talk to him for you. Or just ask him on date. I couldn't. What if he says no? Hey. You always go out with me? Maybe you could ask him for me. I, I mean, a no would still be bad. But it won't be quite as embarrassing if you ask. Oh, God. Oh, Mr. Nandi's doing that thing where he breathes through his nose real slowly. I'd better get back to work. All right. Um, did you see Sebastian? He doesn't talk much, but he's got this quiet intensity, you know? Like there's stuff going on inside his head that you have no idea about. Plus, he's got great legs. I do. It's hard to find a man who doesn't skimp on lower body exercises. I don't. Um... There's other fish in the sea, Celia. Oh, that's all I need Sorry. to Sorry. Sometimes I get carried away. That's all right. Talk to you later. Hello, sir. Well, new business turns up at last. Celia, didn't I tell you our new statistics-based advertising model would be a hit? It was. That you know. did, sir. How can yield improvements of 26.7% not quicken the pulse? How can 32% cost savings not moisten the law? I don't even know what this guy's talking about, guys. I've often posed these very questions. <sighs> Clear my schedule. This newcomer has a meeting with me. All right, well, um, it's very generous Celia, of you. Celia, will you make a note of that for my self-review? Very generous. Noted. But not so generous I can't drive a good bargain. Now, who sent you? Rizzo's, perhaps? Or Auntie Cleo herself? Um... I'm just... For the information Hiram? broker. Why, he's probably still out at Devil's Peak, but... I don't care. Um, just tell him where to get out of here. Could direct you best. See okay, blah, 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 blah. Thanks to this... Now, we've kept... Uh, you talk like Grant. I used to be. God damn it! It's coward's answer. People to look at. That on. You are. But we can't. Con and it's a two. Uh, fine. With a Bolt 52 cartridge. If you can get us what we need to rejoin the board, starting the Bolt 52. And you'll have a powerful. Uh, where do I find one? Do be careful. Oh, and what? Sure, bye. Oh, my goodness. Ah, so much to do. Anyways, guys, I'm going to have to end the video here. I hope you enjoyed it. Once again, please remember to like, comment, subscribe, turn on notifications, and spread the word. And have a happy rest of your Halloween. I'll see you next time. I'm your host, Captain Jeff Goat, and I'm out. Peace.